All right, guys, we've got some absolutely brand new irons to test. Brand spanking new, never even been on the market before. So it's like reincarnation of a, of a super old iron, and it's the Ben Hogan irons. I can't wait to test these, it look sublime. You can see some images up on screen there at the moment. A couple of unique selling points. There is no a kind of set six iron, five iron, seven iron, whatever. They're a lofts. So they go from anywhere from 20 degrees aloft all the way up to 60. They've got all them lofts. So you kind of would work with your custom fitter, whoever you're gonna get custom fit with, and would absolutely dial in the shots. Now, some of these lofts that I've got here are kind of half clubs. It's like a five and a half iron. So you could really tailor in the way that you, kind of the distances you hit the ball. And they just look amazing. They're so slim line. So I'm gonna start off with, we're gonna go 41 first. So this is, uh, it's probably about like a nine iron really, 41 degree loft. We've got GC2, I'm hitting real golf balls down here at the Orlando trade show. Um, first impression, as soon as I look at it, it just, it just looks so classic. It is such a tidy, clean line of an iron. It really is gorgeous. Um, nice, solid, thick Lampkin grips. These are the uh, Ace grips, but they're in a really nice kind of navy blue and red. Um, looking down at the ball, just, just blades. Just real classic blades. Love it. It's kind of like, you know, if you ever was to, you know, pick up an old club from your granddad or your grandparents, you could imagine it's looking like this. This is just a new reincarnated version of it. A little bit of chunk at the back of the head, so it's gonna give a plenty of power. So I'm gonna hit nine iron, and see how it feels, see how it cuts through the grass, most importantly. Oh, wow. That, that cut through the grass so incredibly well. It kind of just glided. At the bottom of the club, there's a, a V-sole. It's forged head, it's got a V-sole. So the front edge and the back edge kind of tails off. Whether that had a big influence, I've had wedges like that before that have been a V-sole and forged. Looks similar to these, actually. Um, wow, so this is like a 99, 151 carry, felt amazing. Oh, yes. It's the way, I don't know what it is, it's the way it, it cuts through the surface. Now, they've actually produced quite shallow divots for a 99. It's almost as if it cuts through in the leading edge, and then the back edge kind of bounces back up again and helps protect it from digging into the floor. 152 carry, just awesome. Uh, right, let's pick another one. I don't know what the uh, club is here. This is 28. 28 degrees, about five and a half iron. It's interesting that you can dial it in that precisely. So it's a five and a half iron, 28 degrees. Is it a five and a half? No, nearer to six. Nearer to six in new money. Let's see how this performs. So again, this is probably a little bit more boxy in the head shape. Oh, it is it's like the flight of it, the feel, 188. It's, it's, it's impossible, it's impossible for me to explain the feel. It, it's it's impossible for me to do so because I'm gonna I'm gonna say this it it doesn't feel like any club I've hit before I couldn't I couldn't even compare it to another club I've hit before with its forged head and that way that it cuts through the surface I don't think they're for everyone now if you're a, don't hit the middle they're gonna punish you they really are but the way you can home in the lofts 188 carry. Just the flight is amazing. Yeah. I like, I like a lot. I really do. Uh, I'm gonna go 21 degrees of loft. So 21, nearer to kind of a three iron now. Still got a little bit of V-sole. Yeah, just a fraction. So even this, the front edge and leading edge is slightly kind of cut through the surface. That's such a classic blade. Tell you what, Ben Hogan irons. You probably never, you would have never seen these on the market at all yet, not even out. Just amazing, right? 21 degree, basically three iron. Right, that wasn't absolutely ripped. I didn't hit that perfect. 219 carry. I didn't, I promise you, I didn't hit that perfect. The only little bit of forgiveness it's got is that right at the bottom, it's chunky. 
it's got a little bit of a chunk at the bottom so with that thin shot that's still produced very i can't describe the feel it's impossible for me to do so because it is doesn't feel like any club i've hit <laughs> 2916 there's not a lot more I can kind of compliment these irons on I'm running out of, of ways of describing it uh, I've just picked up another club this is 34 degrees so kind of 8 time eight range they've been pretty true to distance so far but let's, this is what's interesting let's say you've got a gap in your set now let's say you've always wanted a 5.5 iron or a 26 degree a 27 degree whatever it is you can now get that with this set which I think is a, a really unique selling point. Let's go one more, let's go to the eight iron. Seriously, 134 degree? 177? It can't be, that can't be right. And it felt that good? Struggling. Right, this is an interesting test. I'm gonna try and chunk this. I'm going to really drive down into this and see what it reacts like when hitting too much grass. Because that's V-sole, I'm expecting it to cut through and then almost bounce back up again. I'm going to really go at this, quite hard descending angle. It just cuts through the surface. It just cuts through the surface, 167. I need to stop hitting these irons. This, this might be a 30 minute review, guys. It might just be me hitting the rest of these irons. The rest of these golf balls, the rest of the other golf balls in the buckets. It's a, an iron I've not felt before. Whether I'd fully use them, I'm not sure. I don't know why. Maybe I'm name branded, I don't know, but certainly ones that you should try. I'm going to go one more at 21. I'm going to try and sneak this out. This, <laughs> this is coming back with me. Right, 21 degrees. I'm going to finish with a little bullet. I'm going to finish with a little 21 degree bullet. Guys, review done. That's it. Not, I'm, not, I'm not hitting the line today. Maybe this one, one more. It's class. Just great irons, just great feel. Love the fact that they've got different lofts. That's it. Cut. <laughs>